Oh my goodness, I just want to keep counting. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27! 27 red coins, look at this guy go! Dang! You can't play the game in here. Don't you do it! <laughs> Either way, it's gonna be fun to watch. <laughs> oh my gosh. Cutie, cutie, look. Look at number five. These are a lot of mouths to feed. Cutie, I want you to work in the sock. They can smell the goodies in there. Oh, 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 number eight might win. Look at this, look at this. Ooh. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You and me, mano y mano. Come on, let's go. I'm gonna get that belly. Pull on that number seven. Pull on that thing. So there you go. Don't tell anyone. Shh, be quiet. There seems to be a bit of a hierarchy in the group. Oh, you're such a good boy. Give it back. Give it back. Oh, cutie, 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 cutie. Look at that shiny nose. Goodness sakes, this patio is packed. You gotta learn how to reach in there like the other ones do real gentle. Good job, Elton John. Well, I still think every sock is still attached. Oh, you're such a big boy. Are you going to play the game while the deer are here? Look at this. Well, hey there, Mr. Wiener. How you doing, buddy? I think people are voting, voting for you for the Oscar. Your performance was stellar. Well, I got a little game for these guys tonight, and a game for us, the audience, and I got to get it out there. We got some uh, numbered socks, one through eight here. They're filled with goodies. I'm going to set that out there. <laughs> you can't play the game in here. Don't you do it! <laughs> I got a feeling one of these is going to get ripped off. Look at the boy making a mess. Oh, my God. So, I got to get this out here. There's some raccoons out there. We're going to play a game tonight. And hopefully, fingers crossed, this works as planned. The plan is this. They rip it off. Whichever uh, number sock gets pulled off of this thing first, they're screwed into place, will be the winner. So pick a number, one through eight. Oh my goodness, he was tackling me while I was trying to set this thing up. This guy is just a monster. I have a cutie monster and gertie monster for names. I don't know why I didn't name him wiener monster. You are such a big monster boy. Yes you are. I'm going to get your cheeks. I'm going to get your ear. Look at you. You're just cheating. That's the game out there. This isn't it. You can't be making a mess like this. You have to work for your food. So in every sock is uh, one cookie crumbled up, five peanuts in the shell, and a small handful of these peanuts out of the shell. So it's even and it should work out pretty good. Oh, look at this soft boy. I love him. Are you going to win the Oscars? Are you going to win Best Actor, Mr. Wiener? I hope you guys saw that video. I put a lot of time into editing that one. That was a lot of fun. Mr. Wiener. Mr. Wiener, give it back. Give it back. Give it back. Goodness sakes. Okay, he's working on sock number three. That's what I need is for him to stay focused on this game. So they can reach in from the other side, and I want to see him figure that out. Or well, you're going to do it again. No, you're not. No. No. No, no, no. Truly a monster. Oh, there's Bashful. Bashful's working on number eight right there. They can smell the goodies in there. Oh, 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 oh. Number eight might win. Look at this. Look at this. This is what I want. I want them to pull with all their raccoon force and rip that thing off the table. Ooh, that's close. Ooh, that's close. Hmm. Maybe this won't work. <laughs> Either way, it's going to be fun to watch. <laughs> oh my gosh. Bashful pulled the whole table. Dang, we got a dog barking. Five deer. Here they are. You know, I got corn scattered all over for the squirrels this morning. I don't know if the squirrels cleaned it up or not. Uh, is this little Napoleon's here? Are you going to play the game while the deer are here? 
Look at this. <laughs> so little Napoleon is trying to, to chew a hole in that sock. Okay, there's still two deer in the yard, and Skittish is coming back. Looks like Elton John is here. He's another uh, contender for Best Actor in the awards ceremony. Uh, little Napoleon doesn't like that. He's very jealous, Little Napoleon. Hi, Skittish. Hi there, buddy. Yeah, this guy is who we don't want here right now because he is going to hog this whole table and not let anyone else play. Little Napoleon has an oversized attitude. Okay, Skittish, now's your chance. Go for number one. You can do it, Skittish. Rip into it. That's right. Rip open those cotton socks. Look at little Napoleon go. Working on number five socks right there. So Elton John's over by number eight. The two deer are out there. Oh, hi there, Elton. Hi, Piano Oon. Here comes Mr. Wiener. He starred in uh, My Other Left Foot. If you saw, and he also starred in uh, the Raccoon Hustle, where he was a uh, a pool player. So I don't know. We could actually get a winner here pretty soon if uh, Skittish pulls on number one real hard and uh, rips it off of that screw. What do you want, Elton? Okay, buddy. Okay, piano oon. There you go. You got those good piano hands. Look at those piano hands go. Well, I still think every sock is still attached. Look at little Napoleon. Come on, Mr. Wiener. Go to town, Mr. Wiener. Ooh, I hear someone chattering out there. There you go. Hey, you be good. <laughs> You want to come in here and uh, be naughty again, I know you do. Yeah, little Napoleon has uh, quite the attitude. There you go, buddy. Want a peanut in the shell? There you go. Although there's plenty in there you could be working on. But I know, he's scary. He's scary with those sharp little teeth. Yeah, he's so worked up, he's choking on his food. Oh my goodness. Each raccoon just has a different personality. Okay, here I come, here I come. Oh my goodness, Mr. Wiener. Just rip my hand off, why don't you? You are such a good boy. Yes, you are. You know, his claws are pretty sharp, but he, uh, he doesn't really dig them too deep into my skin. Not where I'm ever bleeding or nothing. But he uh, says, your hands stand right here and it's mine. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> so he's a very determined boy. <laughs> Skittish is ripping open that sock. He is working on it with his teeth. Look at that. Ooh, they're having fun. Yeah, this is a good challenge for him. Uh, this was Martina's idea. Martina is in Europe. You may have seen uh, her drawings that she does on my raccoons. Amazing talent. Oh my goodness, Mr. Wiener. You're just pulling my whole arm out there. Look at that feisty boy. He's like, everyone stay away from my socks. This is my laundry. Get your own laundry. Well, I don't see the deer anymore, but I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven raccoons here. We got Mr. Wiener. We got Skittish. We got Cleopatra. We got Little Napoleon. We got Ent Elton John. We have Klaus right there. Uh, looks like Excitable Jill. Uh, bashful out there and a few babies. Uh-oh. They look a little startled. I don't know if the deer are coming back or what. Hi, Skittish. There you go. Make it easy for you. You're such a cute boy. Here comes Cutie Monster. So Cutie Monster was up for Best Actress in the Oscar nominations for her uh, role in the camping uh, movie. Yeah. She walked right into the tent of the campers and had her way. Oh, cut it out. There you go, cutie monster. 
Yeah, I wish this boy wasn't on here. I might put some peanuts out there to get him off. In fact, maybe if I put some peanuts in the water bowl and he sees that, that'll get him off the game. He is just... He's not very polite like the other ones are. Hey, little Napoleon. Look, 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 look. Hi, kitty monster. Hi, sweet girl. Hi, Klaus. How you doing, buddy? Haven't seen you in a while. Hey. I know, cutie. Okay, sweetie. I feel bad for you after he did that to you. So there you go. Don't tell anyone. Shh, be quiet. Little Napoleon, you're being a bummer on this whole game. <laughs> He's just such a monster. <laughs> oh, that was me. I got your tail. Look at him go. <laughs> he needs to channel all that energy, that crazy energy, and tear one of these socks off and uh, have a winner. But instead, he's going to focus on this. Look at Moira out there. Miss Moira's also up for a Best Actress Award. She played the uh, jazz guitarist, or the blues guitarist in the movie. There you go, Moira. She's a sweet old mama. So I hope you guys check out that video of the uh, Raccoon Oscar ceremony. Hopefully every year we can do this. This is I still haven't even had my channel for a whole year yet. Coming up in a couple weeks will be the one year anniversary. And I'm getting excited about that. Now we got dogs again. Yeah, Mr. Wiener, you know that dog's on a leash, don't you? You're such a monster, little Napoleon. I'm going to spank you. Cutie monster. You know where there's cookies? In every sock. Look, cutie. Cutie, look. Look at number five. Do you smell the cookies in there? How bad do you want it? You stay away, little Napoleon. You know, now that he's off the board, I might just keep him right here with peanuts. Hey. Right here, over here, over here. Let people work on the socks. You're being such a boss of the applesauce. Oh, you're a good boy. Oh, what can you do? <laughs> it's no fault of his own. That's just how nature created him. Whereas this guy was created so gentle and so polite a uh, little Napoleon, not so much. There, go over there. <laughs> I keep trying to, to get him away with food. Looks like it might work now. If I could get him in that water bowl over there, that would be perfect. And we have a chance. Okay, cutie. What are you guys doing? You guys are supposed to be on the socks. You guys are cheaters. You know how to come straight to my heart, pull on my heartstrings, and get your way every time. I can never say no. I'm weak, I'm weak, I'm weak with these guys. There's Elton John. Look at this tangled mess with the socks. There you go, buddy. You're so cute. Cutie, I want you to work in the sock. In the sock are cookies. Yeah, they got me figured out now. Oh, little Napoleon's being something. He is riled up tonight. Okay, skittish. I got you, sweetie. You're so good. You're so good, too. You're the best kids. Yes, you are. I'm so lucky to have all of you. Oh, finally, cutie's going to town on a sock. Ah, end of that. What's wrong, cutie? I'm gonna get 
Look at that belly. <laughs> Hi there, buddy. Hi there, buddy. Oh, you're such a good boy. Your brother's so good, too. Skittish is such a good boy. I know what you're saying out there. What about the game? Can you say no to these faces? Can you blame me? Oh, here comes Hefeweizen down the walk right there, that blondish color one. What do you want, Elton? Oh, I know what you want. You want that cookie. Oh, did you hear the word cookie? Did you hear the word cookie? Oh, you be nice to your sister. Oh, I got those soft cheeks. Oh, I got those little hands. Hey, cut it out. You know what? You're a handful. You're a, quite the monster. Mano y mano. Come on, let's go. Yeah. I don't know how to change that behavior. I really don't. So let's have a count here. It's starting to build up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. We're getting up there now. Isn't that right? For early March, that's pretty good, skittish. Stop it. Beauty, why don't you want peanuts? They're good for you. They're good for you. Okay. There you go, cutie. You just stick with the peanuts, wiener. Or do you want a whole cake? You like cake? So, skittish isn't quite at the point of Mr. Wiener where I can just continuously pet. Skittish is a little more skittish. That's the name. And Skittish had those qualities as a baby. Now, Cutie used to be a little bit more like Skittish, and over time has gotten more like Mr. Wiener. Tolerates me uh, petting her and roughhousing with her. We gotta learn how to reach in there like the other ones do, real gentle. Good job, Elton John. So Elton John reminds me of Mr. Wiener at that age. I see Moira up there. Okay, Moira, there you go. She's really changing through the years. She used to own this area and decided who was allowed in or not. And now she's, uh, she's staying more on the outskirts. Wait a second, there's Moira there. Who was pretending to be Moira over there? Moira? Hurry up, get it, big mama. Good job. Look at that beast over there. Wow, I hope Gertie comes. I wanna see Gertie next to that one. Don't have a name for that one. Still learning it, and it's still learning me. Wiener, what do you want? Oh, you're such a big boy. Look at you. You're so big and impressive. How about you, Klaus? You want that cookie? Yes, you do. So Klaus is Elton John's brother right here. Cleopatra is their mom, and they both are wonderful little kids. Oh, who's standing out there? There you go. Yep. Okay, let's practice, Elton John. You gotta practice being gentle. Don't dig the claws in. Mr. Wiener, I'm training him to be just like you. Well, meanwhile, while I'm talking, I think Nervous Nelly's baby is uh, ripping into the number one sock. Let me see if they're all there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. What do you want? What do you want? You want this cookie, don't you? <laughs> Look at that, folks. Oh, Brutus is here. Okay. 
There you go, Elton. You're so good. What's wrong, Skittish? I thought you were Mr. Wiener. You're going to chew on my finger again, aren't you? He's been wanting to do that lately. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Well, again, and it's all my fault, I've distracted these guys from uh, doing the challenge at hand because I want their full undivided attention and I want hands-on action with them. Cutie, are you just going to come in the house? Oh, cutie, 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 cutie. Look at that shiny nose. Elton John, let me see your cute nose too. You have a much more narrow face. You're like skittish right there. And I think that just makes him so cute. His brother, it's just a slightly wider than his. The eye bands are slightly different. And the fur color is definitely lighter than Elton's. Because everyone's always asking, how can you tell them apart? And there's Hefeweizen. Has light color fur. See that orangish tail? So to me, they all have uh, unique personalities. You've seen his personality on display tonight. A grumpy little boy. There you go. Moira, it's right up by the bird bath for you. Look down. Look down, Moira. She's getting old. <laughs> I hope she gets it. <laughs> There you go, Elton. What about you, kitty? You're not happy with that little piece, I know. What do you say, Klaus? What do you say? There you go. Not quite as gentle as Elton, but he'll get there. Here you go. Okay, Elton. So here's the thing. I want you to get the cookies out of the sock. Okay? You can't eat my thumb. I know you want to eat me, but you can't. So if you saw, he just did a little bite on my thumb. And I trust him not to bite full in. He's just going, is there a cookie there or not? Cutie. Cutie, and here's cookies. Smell. Smell it, cutie. You gotta work it. I know. It's easier to work me. <laughs> Moira, you're pathetic. She just won't come in that much anymore. So I gotta do a perfect shot like that so no one else interferes. And then she's happy, but she knows that's what I'll do. That's why she stays right there, and she stares a hole through me, and she has me dutifully trained. I'm not training them. They're training me. They are the smarter of the species here. And this new one is learning to look at me, going, I'll take a treat. Is that midnight right there? Look how dark midnight is. Beautiful. If that's midnight, there's Brutus. Brutus is licking his lips. Hi, Brutus. Oh, yeah. We got a crowd tonight. Holy cow, look at them all. For March? I'm thinking of March of last year. I wasn't even filming for my channel yet. I was just recreationally filming them and feeding them. And there was a lot of snow on the ground at this time last year. But now it's totally different this year with this El Nino weather. I don't know, I gotta do another count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 22 raccoons in early March of 2024. And another one. Unbelievable amount of raccoons for this time of year. Nothing at all like last year. Wow, what a difference. 
You want this, don't you? Klaus says, I got it first. Okay. There you go. Is that you, Heather? I think it is. Uh-oh. It's nice and good and expensive is what it is. These are a lot of mouths to feed. Well, just come on in, cutie. Come on in. Did I ever tell you how soft you are? Such a soft, sweet raccoon. Skittish, why don't you let me pet you that much? You just let me touch you a little bit. There you go, Heather. How you doing, Wiener? So Wiener's sticking around a long time tonight. I notice he, uh, he comes fast and he goes fast. Here's Grizz. That's one you don't want to see get rough. He's a very powerful male. There seems to be a bit of a hierarchy in the group with the males and with the females. It's more on display with the females comes baby season. That's when they start to push their weight around and they say, hey, I'm vulnerable, I'm pregnant right now. Or they say, hey, I have babies. And they push the males out. But this time of year, the males are, uh, they'll stand strong against other males that approach them. Like, Mr. Wiener is very submissive. He'll go up to the big males like uh, Hefeweizen or uh, Grizz and even Brutus and he'll, lo he'll get real low to the ground and he'll chatter with his mouth. Kind of like you see with uh, wolves. They do that similar submissive display. They get real low to the ground. You can just see a little bit there with Brutus and Hefeweizen where Brutus was being submissive to Hefeweizen. Now Grizz, I never see Grizz be submissive to anyone because he's darn near the top of the pack as far as the males go. So I'm no expert on raccoons. This is just my own observations from what I conclude uh, observing them night after night after night. So don't take what I say to the bank exactly, but I mean, how many people have clocked in as many hours with raccoons as me? Not too many. Okay, there's Circus Circus out there. Goodness sakes, this patio is packed. These are the numbers I was seeing in October. So that was Grizz that just uh, had a little blow up on that really big black one that I'm guessing is a female. It's usually just the layout of their body design. Longer and narrow are the males and more round and hefty are the females. But it's not like I uh, flip them upside down and check for sure. Goodness, we got a crowd tonight. There you go, Elton. There you go, Wiener. Oh, you guys are wonderful. Heather, all the time with you. You're always pulling that step out. Why? Why is that your favorite move? So Mr. Wiener spit that out. That's funny. Are you such a good boy? You're not happy with the little pieces. Is that what you want? Are you gonna get that, Heather? Are you gonna get that, Heather? All right, so Grizz is working on a sock there. We could get a result with him, he is strong. He might pull that whole table though. Wow. Tons of raccoons here tonight. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to uh, throw a bunch more dog food out here. And I think I'm gonna have to spread it out farther so there's no fights. Come on, give me a winner. Pull on that number seven. Pull on that thing. <laughs> so if I do this competition again, maybe I just gotta do it with clothespins or something so that it does release and we get a for sure winner. 
And that one is really even and hoeing. Trying to rip it open. That is fun to watch though. Oh my goodness, I just want to keep counting. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27! 27 raccoons, look at this guy go! Dang! Unbelievable! I was not anticipating this tonight. When we were at 16, I thought I was at my max, not this. Wow. It's like the whole October, October group is back. And I don't even see all my uh, ones that I have names for, so there's more out there. And I'm still in awe of that, how many live in this area. Okay, you be careful with Grizzy. You're just going to keep standing out there? You too, Circus Circus? Yep, those are my standards. Look at them. They never let me down. Well, you know what, guys? I'm almost out of battery power here. So you know what, guys? I am just going to call it a night. I'm going to say happy Oons Day. It's getting feisty out here. I've had to really broadcast food all over the place to keep things calm. Because when there's this big of a number of raccoons, it gets dicey. They start to get very competitive with each other. And I don't want to see fur flying. I want everyone to be happy and healthy. So I'm going to get some more dog food out there. I'm just going to load up tonight, seeing that we have close to 30 of them here. So, man, what a, what a night of raccoons. I am blown away by the numbers that showed up tonight. Was not anticipating this. Happy Oons Day, everyone. Have a good one. Well, guys, I stayed up a little later to see. Hi, Gertie. And number three just got ripped off. I wish I had that on film, but this has been going on for many, many minutes. I'd be out of film. Number three just got ripped off, so we have a result. Whoever picked number three was the winner. Hi, Gertie. You big, big mama. You gonna eat me? Yeah. <laughs>